Hey guys, this is Courtney, creator and founder of Sewn With Strength, and I am back for Tuesday Tips. I wanted to share a little travel tip with you this week, um, as well as a nutrition tip for me, uh, because I get really distracted by breakfast buffets. I absolutely love them, um, which is fine to do every now and then, but when I have my own fitness goals and I'm trying to stay on track with my nutrition, um, and really for me not... Um, binge eat or not encourage any of those behaviors because I've had patterns of that in the past. I need to focus on getting a nutritious meal in um, as well as saving money. When we go, we want to be able to travel a lot. So if I can save some money here and there on different um, food groups and then maybe go out to lunch or dinner and save on breakfast, that's awesome. So today's tip is all about um, breakfast and uh, travel and nutrition and the way that I have come up with saving a little money and still staying on track with my nutrition is with oatmeal. Um, it's a great meal to bring with you. It's super easy to pack um, and it's really easy to make because you can usually just add hot water and let it and stir it and sit for a while. Uh, so for me, I pack a little container of oatmeal, easy to pop in my bag. Um, and I love my oatmeal with apple, and that's easy to pack as well, and it usually stays pretty good for a day or two if you're traveling. Um, so I brought this with me here in Budapest. I'm in the hotel room now. I just had my workout, so this is my breakfast for today, and I'm not gonna get off track by the pastries, which I love at the breakfast buffet. So um, this is really helpful for me, and normally hotels will have something like this in the room. Um, so if you do need to sweeten it up a little bit, there's, you know, sugar or whatever, um, I prefer cinnamon in my oatmeal, so um, I'll normally pack a little bit of cinnamon to go and mix in with my with my food. And then normally they have um, stirring spoons or whatever for the coffee and tea, so perfect. You have your utensils. Uh, and then my room, um, and a lot of rooms in Europe will come with like a little water heater for the coffee and tea part, but I use it for my oatmeal. So it's super easy to make just here in my room. If you don't have a water heater, I'm sure you can just go ask them for some a cup of hot water or something that's free, not a big deal. Um, and then you can go out and spend money on shopping or lunch or dinner or whatever and save some calories and not feel so guilty when you're traveling. Um, I think that that's really important to maintain a healthy lifestyle even while you're on the go because that is still part of life. It's not just like a break in like those calories or those um, that nutrition doesn't affect you. Uh, it does affect your body. And so um, especially with traveling and being tired and um, just the jet lag or whatever you might have, it's so important to get in these healthy meals and make sure that you maintain um, nutritious food coming in uh, at whatever level that you can. So for me, this is it. I'm going to go enjoy my breakfast now that I finished my workout, and I hope you guys have a great day. Um, if you'd like more tips, make sure you subscribe to my YouTube channel here. Uh, for every Tuesday, I'll be sharing some sort of tip for you last week uh, or two weeks ago. I was talking about my morning routine and different tips that I use for that. Um, and this week was a nutrition and travel and saving tip. Um, so please subscribe so that you can get the next tips straight away. And if you want to find me on my other pages, you can find me on Instagram at Sewn With Strength. And then Facebook like page is also Sewn With Strength. If you'd like to directly contact me, you can reach me at sewnwithstrength at gmail.com. I'd love to be in touch with you guys and help you with any of your fitness and nutrition goals. That's my passion as a coach. Um, I want to help you reach those goals. Uh, I look forward to hearing from all of you, and I hope this was helpful. If it was, share it, like it, comment, whatever. I will talk to you guys next week. Bye.